Hi, I am Victoria McLean and welcome to my Truffle Shuffle channel. <laughs> Adam, right because this video is sponsored by truffle shuffle so thank you very much truffle truffle shuffle he said what goonies <laughs> do you know i thought the same i mean god you know i i grew up with goonies you know goonies is one of my favorite films it's awesome i love it um and as soon as i said truffle shuffle to my husband he just was just like <laughs> Oh, but no, Truffle Shuffle is an amazing website and I have a fantastic box that's been sent to me. I'm looking over at it because it's like huge. Um, so if you'd like to see what's inside this fantastic box, then keep on watching. If you would like me to bring Hogwarts to you, then make sure that you subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that all important notification bell as well. Let's get started. <gasps> So today I decided to use Mr. Cedric Diggory. Cedric. I think you know what? I think I have to say that every time I pick up this wand and be moaning Myrtle for two seconds. Cedric. <laughs> oh, love her. She's such a sweetheart. She's one of the oldest, the oldest students, oldest actors to play a student in Hogwarts was. I can't remember my name now. Yeah, so this is Cedric's wand. And do you know what? Whenever I look at it, I think um, Trivial Pursuit. I'm, I can't be the only one, come on now. Because look at it, right? You've played Trivial Pursuit, you know you have to get those little pieces of pie and every time when you fill the pie with the different colours, then you have a chance of winning. But then these just remind me of Trivial Pursuit pieces, don't they? And then you've got gorgeous runes here as well. I'm not sure what those runes mean. If anyone knows, then make sure you let me know in the comments below. But as I always say, I'm going to put it back before I break it. So to get straight into this Truffle Shuffle box, it is a big one, okay? It's a big one, so let me just, let me, let me just get it, yeah, just get it, yeah. It is big and it's really heavy, all right? So this is it. It weighs a ton, absolute ton. So we're gonna get straight into this box now. So very carefully, only using the tip of my knife. I don't wanna cut anything inside. And at the top it says, fragile, handle with care. I do know what's in this box, okay? Uh, because we needed to make sure I didn't already have the items. Um, all the links will be down below. They are affiliate links, but every little helps oh they're after they look at that they're a, they're a company after my own heart i got sweets <laughs> wow oh my god I got, oh my god they filled the box with sweets that's what it is right you lied to me didn't you truffle shuffle this box isn't full of anything apart from sweets will i complain probably not although the items they're sending me are pretty good right okay so i'm very carefully open this box is huge look at the size of it we have a piece of paper which says, Hi Victoria. Hi, that was very high pitched. Hi Victoria. Hope you enjoy these magical Harry Potter goodies. We hope your new, uh, I won't say what that is. Well, actually, no, I will. We hope your new Niffler behaves. Love Truffle Shuffle. Oh my God, right? There's a Niffler in here, guys, okay? I bet you're all peaked now, aren't you? Yeah, you are. I can see it now, aren't you? They snuck him in, didn't they? Uh, and I ain't complaining. Look at all these sweets. Look, 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 look. Look at this, look at this. Do you guys want me to get fat? Look at this, look at this, look. Harry's gonna have a field day if he can get them off me. Look at him, look at him, look at him. Look at him, look at him, look at him. You, there is actually a cocktail, right? Where you, because when I worked in the bar, we had, look at these, look at them all, look at them all. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Oh, you know, if they were sparkly, they wouldn't be alive now. They'd be hidden somewhere. Oh, there's more! I got some more sweets! I got sweets for the rest of my life. Just checking there's no more in here without me looking at anything. Anyway, there's a cocktail that we used to do in work. You crush these up, right? And uh, you get a lime wedge and you put it around the edge of the, the, I think it's a gin glass, but it's not gin. Or is it gin? It's one of the gins. It's one of the gins we did. And you put it inside the powder of these. It's the pestle and mortar you used to grind them up. Oh my God, it's amazing. Did it with Parma violets as well. Okay, so I'm taking all the padding out, which let's face it, you want, oh my God, there's more <laughs> You want to see lots of padding, right? Maybe. Oh my god, there's more again. Oh, this is so fun. 
many? Hang on, how many packets? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. <laughs> twenty-two packs of sweets. This is crazy. Okay. Oh my god, twenty-three. This is mad. Right, you can't see. Good. I'm hoping you can't see what's in it. Because oh no, my god, twenty-four. unboxing of the sweets this well oh this is so funny okay any more sweets double checking but as i was saying this is what yeah more oh my god 24 25 26 oh this is so funny oh so we had glitter in my last video sparkles and now we've got sweets in the next one oh yeah, can you, you can't see that, can you? That's good. Right, okay, so I'm going to put the box down. Oh my God, that's heavy. That is crazy. Right, so we're going to get into... Look at all these, look. Look at all of them, look, 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 look. <laughs> what are we going to do with all these sweets? Oh, that's so funny. Oh, I'm warm now. That's really just made me laugh. Okay, so we're going to get into the first item, right? This is a beautiful, beautiful item. And I love the fact that you guys have packed it so well. Um, because it is glass. So we're going to open it now. I, I mean, obviously, pictures don't do things justice, do they? That's the thing. One of the items, the Niffler now, that I'm going to talk to you about. As far as I'm aware, the pictures of the Niffler online don't do it justice at all. But I am very excited about the Niffler. I'm very excited about this one, actually, because my friend Natalie, one of my patrons, only very recently sent me the link to this, um, which is absolutely beautiful. There's no more sweets in this now, is there? Oh, that was so funny. That's really made me laugh. Okay, so we ready? Wow, this is properly packaged. You guys weren't messing about, were you? That's fantastic. That's what you want to see. You want to see that things are packaged well. So we have a box, a brown box. Those sweets have properly made me laugh. I think about a sugar rush without eating any sweets. Hey, wouldn't that be good? Do you know what my sugar rush is? Nutella with a spoon. I love that I love. Okay, so I'm opening it very carefully. Oh wow, okay. Good. It's in it's oh my god, this thing has been packaged in packaging in a box in a box. So now you're gonna see what it is. <gasps> I love the box. I love the box, and it's by Half Moon Base, so you know it's gonna be good. This is a snow globe, a platform nine and three quarters snow globe by Half Moon Bay. But look at the box. Isn't that gorgeous? It's not just a normal plain box. It is an actually beautiful box. That is stunning. Plenty of padding inside, which is what you want to see when it's something glass. <gasps> that is beautiful. Oh my God, I love snow globes. I have a whole shelf dedicated to snow globes in my front room. Look at that. So you've got the trolley halfway through the wall at platform nine and three quarters just there you can see the trolley and you've got the signs you've got platform 10 and platform 9 there so obviously he's running between platforms 9 and 10 you've got platform 9 and 3 quarters sign in the middle and then you've got brickwork all around the side and then at the front you actually have the Hogwarts Express coming through an arch there isn't that beautiful this snow globe is stunning and i love the box it comes in because a lot of things at the moment the packaging's quite boring and i, I sounds awful but if you've noticed with harry potter items the packaging is pretty to look at but they don't really think about it however half moon bay have really thought about this it's almost like you're opening an exotically expensive watch, you know, or a gorgeous Swarovski Chris, a Christmas decoration. I love Swarovski. We've got Half Moon Bay down the bottom there, and it's obviously the picture around the side. Underneath you have the all-important information that shows this item is an officially licensed Warner Brothers item from Half Moon Bay. They are brilliant, Half Moon Bay. I love them. But this snow globe is so pretty. 
that is absolutely gorgeous now your problem you'll have is which side to display it on that side or that side i think what i would do is i have a really a, a really beautifully decorative mirror of error said and i think what i'd like to do is put it in front of my mirror of error said so you can still see both sides oh my god i'm still exhausted from laughing at the uh, the amount of sweets i've got harry's going to come home from school in about half an hour no no 20 minutes and all i'm going to do is show him those sweets and he's probably going to grab them and run upstairs because as you know he's a little bugger he's only got three weeks left in school and then he's off to big school my last child in primary <laughs> but i have things like this to keep me occupied so i ain't complaining right so the next item when they sent me the picture of these right because I've mentioned it before, you guys know what I love, what I'm really fussy about my socks. You know I'm fussy about my socks. I know a lot of you said the same thing. When they sent me a picture of these, it was like, oh my God, I have to have those socks. So it was like, yes, please, I want those socks. So we have some platform nine and three quarters. Are they platform nine and three quarters? Yes, platform nine and three quarters. The Luffy socks from Truffle Shuffle. Um, oh my God, they feel like silk. Look at these socks, okay? Just look at them, just look at them. <gasps> they are so good. They are so soft and fluffy and they are mine, okay? Mine, not yours, they are mine, okay? They're mine, they are mine. And I cannot wait to put them on my feet. I love them. Not having them. I want them all. These are beautiful. The feel of just, do you know, if you had a jumper like this in, in the winter now, in the autumn and the winter when it gets a bit colder, we, I would just sit there and I would just hug myself the entire day. <laughs> and then with these on my feet as well, I'd be a winner. Oh my life, they are so soft. Right, okay, so I'm, I'm gonna stop feeling these socks up now. Okay. Oh my God, the inside. Look at the inside. Look at that, just look at it. Look at those, they're soft. So instead of saying, it's so cute, I'm saying, it's so soft. I love them so much. Okay, I'm gonna put the socks down now. Victoria, put the socks down, put the socks down. I'm putting them down, they're down, okay? Hands are empty, right? So we're going to move on to the next item. So I have a... Oh my God, I forgot how much was in this box. Oh my God, I got more sweets. <laughs> I got another one. <laughs> if I start finding these in the cracks of things, like sand gets in, I'm going to be laughing so hard. Okay, right, so let's be professional now. Professional. Um, so we have a pair of... I'm really a catch. So we have a pair of Quidditch pyjamas. Um, so these are ladies pyjamas, 100% cotton. So let's open these. I'll show you the back of them. So there they are. That's what it looks like at the back. So these are pyjama bottoms, but I'm going to open them instead to show you properly. These are size 16 to 18 because I am size 16 to 18. Even though I've lost weight, it's not enough. I need to lose more. Especially when you put on a, a t-shirt, right, that used to be massive and you put it on and it's like... <gasps> Okay, that wasn't what it was like before. The t-shirt shrunk. I swear, the t-shirt shrunk. Oh my God, these are lush. These, and of course they're blue. It's the blue it is. The blue, the blue, the blue colour. So these are the pyjama bottoms. I don't wear pyjama bottoms in bed, but I wear pyjama bottoms all through the day because I work from home. I'm in my pyjama bottoms now, you just can't see. <laughs> if you remember the VA, right, which is the Victoria's Army, and I have people like Janice over to stay, the, uh, the lovely lady took a picture of me in, in my pyjama bottoms that were three quarters of the length, three quarters of the way up, right? With my socks pulled up and my slippers. From there up, I'm glamorous. From there down, I'm a mess. So, uh, but with these, I wouldn't be a mess. I'd at least be in, um, but these are Harry Potter pyjamas, aren't they? Yeah, they're Harry Potter pyjama bottoms. I'm not, you know, completely unruly. I do have Harry Potter pyjama bottoms on. So if you remember the VA, you see all sorts of pictures that Janice posts up of me behind the scenes. Don't worry, I'll get her back. But these are size 16 to 18. They look, oh wow, okay. The first pair I had in this sort of style, the top was very big. Um, these are going to fit me perfect. 
they are going to fit me perfect i love the pattern so you've got obviously the quidditch hoops which match the top okay but we're going to talk about that after uh, so we've got the quidditch hoops we've got the the um bats for the beaters we've got the golden snitch we've obviously got harry potter written there covered in stars as well they are really nice but i don't think i'd get away with wearing them outside of the house honestly you guys think i'm so glamorous i'm so not i'm only glamorous to videos okay so here we go we have the top oh my god i love that <gasps> The glitter really helps, mind. You know with me, with my glitter. That is gorgeous. Look at that. That is so amazing. Again, all the details will be down below for you. So all the links will be down below for these. These are stunning. Look at that. Oh my God, that is lush. The material is so soft. Do you know what? I'm going to wear these tonight in bed. Maybe I'll take a photograph and share it with you guys just ignore the fact that I won't have any makeup on I'm not glamorous in bed obviously but that is so lovely and my bedding at the moment is also blue so it'll match um, but that is really lovely so again this is size 16 to 18 that is a nice size and those pajama bottoms look so comfortable right okay so very excited about bedtime it is a bit warm to wear these at the moment but when it's not too warm oh my god i do actually get i've said it to you before i get really cold when i'm editing um i've got like about 10 videos i've got to edit over the next couple of days those socks as well as the door the slippers that my daughter bought me for christmas just go in the microwave these socks and those slippers will warm me up in no time because we've actually got some cold weather coming so i don't normally say this but hurry up <laughs> so i can hurry up and wear these things right so we've got another item that I had to have when they sent me the picture of the Qu not the Quidditch of the Gryffindor item. I was like, no, 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 no. Um, very much appreciated, but I am a proud Ravenclaw. And then they sent me the picture of the proud Ravenclaw one, and I was like, uh, gotta have it, gotta have it, gotta have it, gotta have it, gotta have it. So let's have a look. This is by Fashion UK. Again, available from Truffle Shuffle. It is, it's a size extra large XXL this is. So they've sent me a big, big one, but you know me, I do like my baggy t-shirts. They've sent me a beautiful Ravenclaw t-shirt. They had all the houses. Or was it a Slytherin one they wanted to send me? Do you know what? I wouldn't have minded a Slytherin one actually. But I did say, if you've got a Ravenclaw one, then obviously by all means. Me being part, part Slytherin, you know, it works. Team Quidditch. So we have another Quidditch style item, property of Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. So there we have it, this gorgeous Ravenclaw t-shirt that I will be adorning for a video very, very soon. Actually, do you know what? I could even wear that in a video. I'd wear that as a normal t-shirt. It sounds really stupid, don't get me wrong, but some pyjama tops are so nice. I want to wear them as normal tops and I could do that with this top. I so could get away with that, with a pair of like black leggings or something, three quarter length leggings. I so would. I know it's not meant to be a pyjama top, but pff, I don't care. So the next item, I did actually see this way before Truffle Shuffle contacted me and I loved it, okay, because I've been following Truffle Shuffle for a while. Truffle Shuffle, I can't say that without thinking of Gita with the uh, Goonies. We have a mat, because my mat is dead out the front of my house and it was a harry potter one i have to use this one this will be now used in front of my house which is welcome muggles tolerated anybody else feel like that don't let the muggles get you down this is brilliant it's going outside my house today i am putting it outside my house today i couldn't wait to get this out of the box this is such a brilliant mat. And of course, you've got the Truffle Shuffle card there to say that it is from Truffle Shuffle. And of course, underneath, it's a lovely kind of, like a non-slip material or like a plastic to keep it all together. But it's also really great for being outside your house. So you know it's not going to move. But that is brilliant. I love that mat. The one I had, I think it was Alohomora, but it died really quick. It actually did die very, very quickly. Within a couple of months, you couldn't see the writing anymore. It was really bad. So I've actually been looking for a new mat to replace the one I've got. So here it comes, the Niffler. 
Are you ready now? <laughs> I'm just showing you that bit. Okay. I don't know if you guys will guess what this is, okay? I'm sure you will, right? So I'm going to take this out of the bag first. This is an officially licensed Crimes of Grindelwald item. So I'm sure you guys know what it is, but I've wanted this ever since I saw it. It's so good. Okay, so are you ready now? Are you ready? Are you, are you ready? Are you ready? Let's have a look. Ready? Are you ready? <laughs> oh my god! Hello, sweetheart. Welcome home. <laughs> You're so adorable. Oh my god, I love him. Oh, Truffle Shuffle, thank you so much for sending him to me. Look at that little face. Look at the little feet. Oh my god, tickle, tickle, tickle. Look at that bag. Now this is a Crimes of Grindelwald Niffler Lounge Fly Backpack. They range from between 70 to 80 pound, I think. Um, but again, all the links will be down below for you. But I've wanted this for so long, right? So long. As you can see, I love my nifflers, okay? I am obsessed with nifflers. You are just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I love on the side here, it says, Fantastic Beasts, The Crimes of Grind... Oh, sorry. Fantastic Beasts. Hang on a minute, yes, yeah, there's Crimes of Grindelwald there, but it says Fantastic Beasts and where to find them there. So that's really good because he is in both films, okay? And it's a lounge fly bag. I love lounge fly so much. I'm building up a really nice collection of lounge fly bags, but this, oh my God, I love him so much. Just gonna like, just, just look at him for a bit. Look at you, and you're so fluffy. Oh. You are so cute. I love you so much. I love your little dinky feet. And he's holding on to it as if to say, you're not having it. You are not having all my things. You are beautiful. So let's have a look at the inside of this bag. Obviously lots of padding, so I'm gonna take that out now. Oh my God, the inside is amazing. Ah! Oh. This is a must for any Niffler fan, okay? Look at the inside. This is the inside of his pouch. Look at all those gold coins. <laughs> He's blooming collecting them. He's hoarding them. You snuck him in, didn't you? That's what he's done. He snuck him into his pouch. But they're not my gold coins, so it's fine. My gold coins are all still there, so it's okay. So we've got lounge fly on the zip in gold. Of course it's gold. It wouldn't be silver, would it? It'd be gold. Of course it's gold. Uh, so we've got gold zips there. And then the inside of his little purse that he's uh, managed to snatch from somewhere. Probably the lady in the bank at Fantastic Beasts and where to find them. We have more padding, so I'm going to take the padding out. And then we have more gold coins in his little pouch there. But isn't that beautiful? Isn't that just fantastic? I love this bag and it's so soft on the back. He's just adorable. I love him so much. I don't know, I, I want to use him, but I'm worried I'll damage the bag but I really want to use it. This is one of the lounge fly bags I have to use because he's got little tufts of hair. Oh my God, he's got little tufts of hair at the top. <laughs> it's like his little feathers. Um, so yeah, this is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much, Truffle Shuffle, for sending me these incredibly magical items and all these blooming sweets. What am I going to do with all these sweets? This is crazy. I have been utterly, utterly spoiled. And even though I know, I knew what was in these box, in this box, having the items to actually physically show you 
is what makes my job so special because seeing photographs or sharing photos for a company isn't enough. Being able to physically hold them and show you close-ups and how they are actually making a Harry Potter fan feel, you know, in this case, in this case, Fantastic Beast fan feel. I mean, I am a massive Niffler fan, you know this, but all of these are fantastic, fantastic items. The matte, the, the snow globe, the t-shirts, the pajamas, everything, the socks, the bag, just outstanding. Standing. I am so incredibly lucky to be able to share this experience with you. I keep looking at his in at my bag and just thinking, do you know what? You are just so adorable. The feel of his fabric is just stunning. I don't know what it is about Nifflers. I just think if anyone could have a Niffler, how amazing would that be to actually own a Niffler? I love them. They are the cutest thing and they purr. Nifflers purr. And I am a cat lady, right? I love cats. So He's like a little magpie, he's just like me. I love sparkle, you know, I love my sparkle. Um, he loves his gold and shiny things. He's like a little magpie, just like me. So Harry Potter stuff brings out my inner Niffler. And I think if I could pick a Patronus, a Niffler would be my Patronus. This is just incredible. I can't wait to put that mat out in front of my house. That is going in front of my house today. Um, the pajamas, I'm going to wear them for bed today the t-shirt will definitely be worn in a future video and this snow globe is being put on my snow globe shelf straight away so thank you so much i can't believe these sweets <laughs> i just can't believe these sweets this is just crazy and uh, this is just mad but thank you so much truffle shuffle for such a fantastic box of goodies let me know in the comments below which ones were your favorite will you be buying any of these and don't forget to check out all the links down below for truffle shuffle so until next time take care i love you all and i will speak to you very very soon bye-bye <laughs>